Hey there guys, welcome to Vector 36, a anti-gravity racing in VR. Playing this on my Xbox 360 controller, it's not compatible with touch controllers or the Vive controllers, uh, but doesn't need to be really. Anyway, it's something I need to throw out about this first impressions um, before we get into it. I did initially have problems with this game when I first got uh, got it, um, but the dev reached out to me and I tell you what, his support was fantastic. He was brilliant. He uh, got me going on the game and yeah, I couldn't fault him. So if you uh, buy this game and you have any problems, please do reach out to the dev. I promise you his support is fantastic. Anyway, this, I have played the tutorial. Um, but this essentially is going to be my first impressions anyway, because I haven't actually gone into the full career mode. Now, the idea of this, here we have um, my hover ship. Now, uh, it's a very basic thing. As you go along, you'll be able to buy new parts, customize it and uh, change things in it, which will affect its handling. Well, we'll see if we can get into that um, after. But first of all, let's get into a race and see what happens. So. I'm in Noctis Loop uh, Lead League. Okay, so $4,000 morning sprint. And I'm assuming that's going to be my reward. So let's go for that. Okay, so let's get ready. So let's get into the vector. Okay, start the engines, pressing start. Using my left and right trigger to uh, use the thrusts. Left stick. Tilt in the ship, controlling the speed. Okay, A to boost. Oh, gotta freeze. Ooh, that wasn't good. Right, anyway, let's get on with it. So yeah, graphically, this is a pretty decent looking game. The world, a little bit quite barren. Very apocalyptic, it's supposed to be based on Mars or something anyway, so it's no surprise. Come on. Ooh, gotta watch my um, engine temperature. Don't wanna be cooking the engine too much, cause it to shut down. Do a little jump with B, try and get some altitude. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. I love the feeling of actually being inside the ship, even though it's a bit strange since I'm holding an Xbox controller in my hand. Still works well. A little bit of a boost. Come on, come on, come on. I'm having a bit of an hard time catching up with these guys. Checked gate, come on. Got a bit of drift going on. So the ship at this time, my ship is. What's he doing? <laughs> <laughs> no idea what that was doing. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. Just got clips from the top there. Right. Need to shift. I'm going to shift my bias. I want to try and get some speed. So I'm going to use my right bumper button. Shift my bias. I'm going to move it to 75. That means I'm going to go faster, but I'm going to get closer to the ground as well. Oh, damage calls, damage calls. Let's shift that bias back. Oh, gosh, I've lost it. Yeah, got to be careful when you're messing with your bias, guys. Right, using B to try and uh, stop myself from bumping off the ground. Right, got a bit of flat surface, so B. Right, let's shift that bias a little bit more, try and get a bit of a speed. Come on, come on, come on. Gonna come down hard. Use a bit of B to uh, up thrust a little. Yeah, I think I've probably done too little too late here. Come on, let's shift that bias a little bit more. Push my luck a little bit. 
So, um, yeah, the more bias I put, 70% at the moment, it increases my speed. Shift it up a little bit more, I'll boost my speed more, but I've got to be careful because that means I'm putting more forward thrust on, less upward thrust. Yeah, that wasn't too good, that. What position was I? Uh, I can't see where I am. Ah, position 5 of 8, so I'm going to give that a quick restart, I think. Uh, I'm going to rework on my tactics. So here we go, start the engine. Press start. Use my right bumper. Get ready to go. Go, 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 go! So at the moment, I'm on 60% bias. I'm going to increase that a little bit, try and get a bit more speed. The more uh, bias I increase, though, the less up thrust I have, which means I risk bumping off the uh, surface. Come on, bump it up a little bit more. Yeah, using a uh, pretty standard ship at the moment, no customization, so uh, I'm not expecting an awful lot, to be honest. Try and count, counter that side drift. Whoa! Use a bit of B up thrust. Yeah, try and uh, avoid clipping that surface. All right, come on. Let's bump that bias a little bit more. Got to be uh, very tactical with my use of engine as well because the last thing I want to do is overheat the engine and cause a complete shutdown. Ooh, he's going for it. Ooh, we're proper going for it. All right, increase that bias a little bit more. Come on, bump it up, 78%. Ah, get out of it. Okay. Where's he going? <laughs> I think he's a bit confused. <laughs> All right, come on. Not too sure what position I'm in at the moment. Yeah, I can't see where I am. Ooh. All right. Oh, speed increase, 79% bias. Really good, I have to be mindful as well, using beads to boost myself up just a little bit. Avoid that surface, I don't want to be crashing, can cause uh, severe critical damage. Come on, gate four. Whoa. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Yeah, the, the actual handling is actually pretty good. It's quite challenging. Obviously, uh, being anti-gravity, that means you've got a lot of uh, movement going around. Oh, boost up. Shifting my bias to 83%. I'm really struggling to keep up with these guys in this early stage. Whoa. So it's to the end of the race. Yeah. yeah, that was the end. Where did it end up there? Is that fifth again? Oh my word. So I've unlocked a track, so yeah, five of eight. So it looks like what I'm gonna have to do is I'm gonna have to do a bit of work on my ship. Okay, here we go. So let's have a look. So this is my garage. So I've got my nano wave entropod two. Ooh, big um Corruption going on with the text there. I'm not too sure what's going on there. Uh, that's not right. That's definitely not right. All right, so I'm going to hazard uh, a guess on what. Oh, what have I just done there? Is this a shop? Okay, yeah. So we're in the shop now. So uh, let's see. Buy skimmers, buy parts, sell skimmers, sell parts. So um, how much do I have? So I've got 44,000 to... No, no, that's the cost of the ship. How much do I actually have? Cannot buy. Right, so it's going to have to be parts. So let's have a look. What parts do we have? So we've got some thrust. We've got lift, cooling, power, fuel, stabilizers, and controllers. So let's have a look at thrust. Okay, so how do I go around the parts here? Okay, so I'm assuming I'll have to tap through these. So price 3,400, mass 300, durability 60 of 100. Um, so, oh, that's not changing anything. Ooh, 
am I limited on what I can buy at the moment? All right, so, right, so that's, ah, I see, I see. So at the moment I've got just really the one thruster to choose from. So I'm gonna buy that, okay. Um, I want some more left as well. I hope to see if that can actually balance out when I'm speeding along, okay. So, I've got, oh, there we go, got uh, 28,900 credits remaining. Uh, hmm. Stabilizer. So that's uh, 2,300, let's buy that. Right, I'm gonna pop to my garage. Right, how do I install these parts? So let's see, garage. Okay. Right, so change test area. What's that? Visual tools. Okay, so that will tell me about my um, center of gravity and stuff. What's this? Move camera. Yeah, but how do I actually customize it? Um, I do feel this could be streamlined a little bit more, make it a bit more obvious. I don't know if it automatically installs the parts after you bought, bought them. Um, let's see, control skimmer. Yeah, I'm a little confused. So let's go to race. Right, so. Tracks three, open to all, not approved, so. Not approved. So I can get in there, the Rust series. Let's have a look. Let's try that out. So, Lana's run. Race one, laps three. Let's go for it. Skimmer approved. Let's get ready. All aboard. Start engine, press start. Got by 60%. Can't even change that at the moment, so let's just go. Right. So, I'm going to increase my bias now. Try and get this speed up a little bit. So, let's go 70% to start off with and see how we do with that. Yeah, I'm not too sure if those parts that I bought are um, actually even installed, to be honest with you. Ooh, got a different layout going on here. Oh, bit of B boost. Try and prevent myself from dropping. Right, I'm going to shift myself to 80% bias. Try and get a bit more uh, forward momentum. I'm having a real hard time though catching up with these guys. That's crazy. All right, I'm going to be a boost. Oh. Up boost, come on. Oh, big canyon. Come on, come on, come on. Woo! He went down. Right, come on. Hey, boost it, boost it. Oh, system okay, so. Right, gonna shift my bias a bit more. I wanna try and get a bit more speed. Not really working out for me at the moment, though, guys. This guy seems to be like crawling it around, but he's still ahead of me. Right, boost, boost, boost. Come on. Let's try and get some forward movement. Oh, wow, where'd he come from? Oh, took damage. Right, come on, come on, come on, come on. Up boost. I'm gonna seriously clip the terrain there. Wow, seriously guys. 
I am struggling. Looks like I'd have... Uh, ooh. Uh, I mean, six of eight. What on earth? Guys, I just can't get my speed up here. Okay. Using a lot of B to try and keep myself up, so um, I'm going to have to reduce the bias. The terrain's just far too bumpy. It's not really benefiting me speed-wise. Having to keep compensating for drop. Alright, let's boost it. Oh, 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 oh. Where am I? Oh, I'm, go I'm way, 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 way off course. Let's go. Oh, overheating. Right. Go. Go, 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 go. Overheating again. Oh. Damn, come on. Oh, I've lost it. Totally. Yeah, I don't think I've got a chance here, guys. Come on. There's no sign of those over uh, races. Still in six. Boost it. Yeah, trying to look at my heads up there to check my position. Whoa! Oh, I'm going to drop. Drop in, drop in. Ah! Ooh, just barely made it across. Damn. I'm going to reduce that bias just a smidgen. The... Uh, whoa! Really don't think I've got a chance here. Oh, I'm being lapped. So, oh, I've took damage. Clips from the top. Took some serious damage there. Whoa, losing it. Ah, crap. Okay. Try and keep it cool. See if we can finish the race. No, I've got a lot of damage uh, here. Oh, looks of it. Okay, come on. It's boosting it. Whoa. Clipped again. Skimmer fire. I'm on fire. Oh. Oh. <laughs> Oh, damn. Well, that didn't go well. So, <laughs> we'll go on to the next race. See what happens. Okay. Last try, guys. I'm going to go for this last time. Start engine. Set. Go. Come on. Let's get this movement going. Crawling. Absolutely crawling, guys. What's going on? Shift that bias. 70%. Boost it. Boost it. Come on. Got to get some speed up. Watch that temperature. Okay. Eighth? No crop, Bennett. Come on. Oh, let's go 75% bias. Overheated. I just can't get this speed up. Oh, 
Okay, come on. Oh, damage. Lost a lot of speed there as well. Really can't afford to lose that speed. I can't see any way that I'm going to catch these guys, though. Come on. Really crawling at slow speed here now. This is driving me insane. Get over that. Come on, get around there. Whoa! Damage. So it seems to be going quiet, guys. Really trying to focus. Okay, got to quiet. Oh, get up. That's it. Okay. Whoa, they drop there. It's swinging around. Come on, come on, come on. Yeah, get out of that ravine. Okay. Trying to boost it as much as I can here. Temperature rising. Ah, cooking it. Swing, swing, swing. Yeah, surprisingly, this game doesn't actually make me feel too bad, actually. Um, I was expecting quite a bit of motion sickness. Which way am I supposed to be going here? I'm in seven of eight. Oh my god, that is just lame. Oh, bumping the terrain there. Checkpoint reached. It's not really doing me any favours for my uh, racing position, though. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Try and get speed up. Overheating again, seriously. I mean, pretty stock ship, this. Uh, no idea if them parts um, actually installed that I purchased. I think I really need to look into it more. Which way am I going? Around here. Ooh, come on, come on, come on. Go, 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 go. Should have the ability to boost up here a bit. Oh, where am I? Oh my, I've been overtaken. That's a lapping. Oh, seriously. Looks like there's a lot of work you have to do on your skimmer before you can actually uh, get anywhere in this game, guys. I've read that you're supposed to be able to uh, win some of the earlier races, even with the uh, basic skimmer. Obviously, I'm going wrong somewhere, though. Left. Come on. Right, I'm going to shift that bias a little bit more. Whoa! Oh! Heavy damage. Lost track of where I'm going. Oh, man. This is just bad. This is beyond bad. Oh! Right. Lost my way again. Seriously. 
Enjoy the music. <laughs> Even though I don't... Oh, I'm on fire. I'm gonna go. Boom. I'm on fire. Yeah. Ships. Ships pretty much had it. It's gone. Shut down. Bad fault. Yeah, I don't... Don't think this is going to take much more. See if I can at least just survive the final part and not end up in last place. I'm pretty near last place. Surprised um, position 8 hasn't already caught me. Ooh. Where's the end? I'm going to have to shift that bias down. Dropping too much. Okay, back into the tunnels. Or well, the caves, should I say. S slow right down in here for some reason. I'm running on a crippled ship here. Rad fault, reactor fault. Yeah. Now oh, I'll get around there. Shift my uh, bias down again, I think. What do you reckon, guys? Am I going to win? Ah, no chance. <laughs> Actually, oh, ah, and I'm out. Oof. Well, guys, whoops, let's go back to the garage. So there you go, guys. Uh, that's a bit of uh, Vector 36. I think I need to actually play this more and actually learn quite a bit more. I guess I'm horrendous on this at the moment. But yeah, I mean, it's really neat idea. I like it. It's kind of like um, got a touch of wipeout type thing, you know, with a zero gravity type thing. Um, I like that idea. Um, graphically, pretty decent. I mean, the skimmers look good. Um, the world, a bit bland. Nothing exciting, but uh, sports on an alien barren planet. Not expecting too much out of it. Uh, really could do with a few uh, bits of work. I, I mean, I have no idea if I actually did anything with my ship. Uh, honestly, it's like, um, okay, let's see, I go to the sh right, garage, there's my ship. Where are the parts that I bought? Did they install what? what? What happened? I have no idea. I really have no idea. Change the test area. Um, yeah, I think the menu could do with a little bit of tweaking um, because I'm confused. Uh, I can go to the shop, I can buy parts, it seems. Um, I just no idea if um, they install or how to install them. Something I'll look into uh, later time, though. But if you guys would like to see uh, progress that I make in this game, then smash that like button, leave a comment down below. And yeah, that's my first impressions. Vector 36, actually a pretty decent game. Um, again, though, remember, if you uh, do buy this game, you have any problems, do reach out to the, dev the developer. And yeah, he's brilliant. He'll uh, get you going in no time. So yeah, if you like this video, smash that like button. Make sure you uh, subscribe as well. And yeah, thanks for watching. I'll catch you later, guys. Bye.